Hello everyone, the Pokemon Fan 1993 here, back with more Pokemon Scarlet. So during the last episode, I did the basic introduction, I selected my starter. Unfortunately, I forgot to say, because I was going to soft reset for a at least a female Sprigato. Sprigatado, however you say it. So I did that, and it took me 15 resets. Which actually, considering that the game takes about 2-3 to three minutes per retry, is actually quite a long time. Like, what is that, like 45 minutes? An hour? So I did that, I managed to get the female. Um, not the best nature. I quickly looked at Spurgato's stats that someone told me. I kind of just, I kind of scrolled really past Quest Derby, so I didn't catch the, uh, I didn't catch the, uh, evolutions or whatever. But, my Spurgato has the increased special defense neighbor, decreased uh, speed. Oh. Did I not notice that before? Oh, yeah. I have to do the battle first, but it looks like they show up on the map, too. That's actually kind of... That actually could make the Pokedex quite easily. Quite easy, I mean. Um, so we're going to the beach to battle What's-Her-Face. Um, so let's have a look at Sprigato real quick. You're going to have to give me a minute because I'm still getting used to this menu thing. So type ter type grass. Terror type is grass. Uh, 135 to level up, or 44 to level up, I should say. Scratch tail whip. Remember moves or get... Wait, can I... I can. Re that seems kind of broken. That you can mess with that. Can I mess with like the way the? There we go. I'm gonna say mess with the way the uh, moves are set up. Uh, sassy nature. That's what it is. Cabo Poco likes to fight. Increase attack nature. Okay, that's fine. All right. Is that? Oh, that is an item. They have a like a little red thing from it. What is this? It's potion. Okay. Anything else around here like that? Can I, like, mess with these trees or anything? They don't look like they have berries on them. I don't know if that's just aesthetic or you can actually get something from those. Nice scenery. Look how they have the little glistening effect, too. How far can I go out here? Oh, cool. That's kind of cool. I mean, scramble back out of the water. Okay, so apparently you can't go too far in there, but you can go to a certain point. Or the arena out here, it looks like. Do I have to... Oh. Um, I want to take a look around and see if she doesn't stop me. Um, <laughs> that looks like no way to go out. He's probably not going to let me go that far. There's an item over here that I want to that I want to grab. What are you? Another potion. Anyone can be Pokemon trainer as long as they have Pokemon by their side. Now, let's do these trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger through battle. So, you ready to battle me, Phoenix? Perfect. I'm so excited for this battle. I think I'll use Miss Nimona. You mean Quaxley? Because that's the only one you're legally allowed to use. I trust you remember that Max Phoenix is the only wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. <laughs> Whoops. Good call, good actor. She, how did you forget that? We, did we meet like five minutes ago? But that's one of my usual partners right off the bat. Gotta take the chance to trap my new buddy instead. Come on, Phoenix. Let's have a fruitful battle. Challenge by Pokemon Trainer Namana. I'm pretty sure it's something that would call him Melanoma or some shit like that. Okay, so. This is the first one battle. Let's have, just have some fun. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, so we check statuses. Oh, we can see the stats of your opponent, too. That's interesting. Nice bag. I can't do run, obviously. Split it up. All right. So we're going to go to battle, and we're going to go to, for leafage, because that should be super effective. It goes for water gun. Not very effective. Miles looking really good this, this game. Was a study up smart move. Grass is strong against water. Growl. It's going to warm my leafage power, but I, is that going to be enough for me to not be able to finish her off on this turn? Yep. Hold on by thread. One more leafage. Goes for water gun. 
All right, that wasn't too bad. Roto gained 63 experience points. Roto over the level 6. Wow, not bad, neighbor. We received $300 in prize money. Okay, you winning your first battle ever. You even got more potential than I thought. You're going to be a strong trainer for sure. No strike, drip strike. Let's go again. Just one more battle. If you need to are surely weary from the last battle. Oh, sorry, I got kind of caught up in all the excitement. She reminds me of Hilda from Black and White. Just the way she likes to battle, like, all the time. I'm really sorry, Phoenix. Same as Brigado, too. Let's battle again soon. Definitely. We'll definitely battle more. Seem to be becoming fast friends, though you just met. Can I tell you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Miss Nimona? I'm sure I can learn a great deal from the shaping right trainer such as yourself. You bet, sir. Reminds me, since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you'll definitely need. Smartphone, right? Let me see it for a sec. Pokedex app was added to your road time phone. So now it's just an app and an actual Pokedex. All right, that's kind of weird. Pokedex will make register any Pokemon you catch. Must have for Pokemon trainers. Super handy app. One, our Roman teacher, Mr. Jock, actually made it himself. Back in my day, we were ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. It's quite the age we live in now. Oh, filling out Pokedex by hand, I can't even imagine how much work that would take. Oh, ho, ho. No, I suppose you can't. Yeah, no matter how much times change, the wondering, wondering meaning of new Pokemon never does. It's truly, time, truly a timeless pleasure. The more one you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. We both work hard toward the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. Now, Miss Nonia, I still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. If you please depend on you to see Master Phoenix to the Academy, you'll be doing quite the favor. Of course, leave it to me. And I'll leave you in your cap him in your capable hands. All right, little one, it's time you and I were on our way. Maybe I'll take a more time to work on my Pokedex along with my all my battling. All right. Think of Pokedex, Phoenix. You probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the rose before I take you to the Academy. Come with me. Press the says open the Pokedex, open the road top of the okay. Easy enough. Oh, Phoenix. Heard that Mona would take you to school. That's right, ma'am. Lead to me. Or I managed to make a friend. Maybe about all one of the teachers you'll have looking after you at school. Plus, there are many handy facilities you can use just as much as you like. And a new friend, Mona, and it sounds like you, your school is shaping up to be fantastic. Now, you'll be staying in the school dorm, so I want to promise you'll eat proper meals. A bit of spending money to start off with. Also, I packed the lunch for your first day. You think the sandwich for mom. Sandwich put in your mom's key item pocket. Sandwich, a dish made by sandwiching vegetables, meat, and other fantastic or ingredients in between two pieces of bread. It makes a fantastic meal when out on a picnic. Maybe you better take these two. You obtain five potions. Use them on those precious little partner of yours should it get hurt in battle. I know you, every day is a new life, and your new life is going to be full of experience. Exciting experience is far from home. Just try to share them all in all the good times and hard times, too. Here, when I come home, you know your bed is ready for you. All right. All right, then. You better head off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. Your mother's so nice, Phoenix. But I'll teach you how to catch the wild Pokemon. Come on, vamos. This way. You know how tempted I am to hit Y to see if I roll and I forget that is this isn't Arceus Legends? Poco Path. Bit of a frame rate issue right there. 
all right, this is Poco, this here is Poco Pass. Path that leads to adventure, adventure for you and me. This new bug type, I think, too. Out here, you're going to encounter things that are indifferent in town. You're going to see wild Pokemon out and about. You're going to, and they'll be on the path in your grass and such. It's close when you have a battle, but you got Sprigato for that, right? When I expect a Pokemon, you got to use a good old Pokeball. I have tons. I've got tons to have a few. So, I actually, um, because I ordered the double pack, um, I actually got 200 Pokeballs, uh, 101 to 100 another. I'm probably going to put 100 into this one, and then 100 into my other one. Just, you know, to make it even. Pokeball, a device for catching Pokemon is thrown like a ball at a Pokemon. Completely encapsulating its target. Comfortably, I should say. Oh, it's Lechonk. Oh, what luck. Time for some learning by doing. Try bailing this Lechonk, Phoenix. Catching Pokemon, okay, that's, yeah. So what type is Lechonk? Is it just normal? Let's go Scratch. I don't want to use Leafage and risk knocking it out. That should be good. Defense fell. X to use a Pokeball. Quick capture, too. Lechonk was caught. For Doki, 20 experience. Number 10, Lechonk. Hog Pokemon, normal. Serves for food all day, possesses a keen sense of smell, but doesn't use it for much anything other than foraging. No. Chuck has been added to your party. Oh, that's cool. Hala, this. Th that was awesome. You caught your very first Pokemon you went for. I'm crummy when it comes to. I'm crummy when it comes to to giving actual, actually catchy Pokemon, so maybe you should give me some tips. Anyway, have more Pokeballs just in case. Never, not every catch works out. Contain 10 Pokeballs. We're going to Pokemon and throw a Pokeball. Remember that and you'll be fine. Now go battle the white Pokemon and catch some of them. Let's back up. Meet up at the lighthouse over there. You can see the school from the top. That definitely sounds like a chunk here times two. That's interesting. Okay. So there's two items around here that I saw. Here's one of them. Potion times one. Another potion times one. Does that mean I can do this? That's not what I meant to do. Oh, hi, Sprig. What's up? Hop hips in this area. Leafage. Tail whip. Defense down. Scratch. Eleven for Sprigato and three for Lechonk. I want to actually take a look at Lechonk real quick. Tackle, Tail Whip, Neutral Nature, Robo Bell, protect the Pokemon from getting allies from the effects that prevent the use of moves. Okay. I don't want to put Lechonk in my party quite yet. Um, or keep Lechonk in my party quite yet. I know Lechonk is, like, the favorite of everybody, but to be honest with you, I, I can't see the point of, like, getting, like, the very first Pokemon I find. Keeping the very first Pokemon I find, so we're going to grab a Pokeball there. Oh, I see you can throw your Pokeball at them to start the battle instead of walking into them. Leafage. Easier to deal with than it is at uh, Arceus, that's for sure. Pokemon battles just one-on-one -on -one are very vicious in that game. Unless you can knock them out in, a few in like one or two turns. Bird will level it up. Or in Bite.
Bite is definitely the stronger move, but Leafage gives it a 1.6 power boost, so Leafage is actually just as strong as Bite. Alright, what about you guys? What are you? Tyranitula. Bug, if he's bugged, I don't think Leafage is going to do anything to it. Tackle. Catch you. Definitely made the Pokemon a lot quicker to catch in this game. Tarantula was caught. A chunk of up to level 4. Well, no, number 9, Tarantula. String ball Pokemon bug. The ball of threads wrapped around its body is less enough to deflect the size of Scizor, this Pokemon's natural enemy. Another entry. So let's check out Tarantula now. Bug, Terra type bug. Male, ta tackle string shot. Adamant nature. Turns the Pokemon from sleep insomnia. Okay. So it's like the only Pokemon that else I can see around here is Hop Hip. Bite. Should bring out at least half, I would think. Wow, well below half. All right, Slash does nothing. So I've seen Pokemon so far here. I think I'm gonna wait and catching another Pokemon probably to my next route. Cause so far, like the Pokemon are interesting, but I've seen Lechomp before. Tyrannosaurus doesn't look extremely interesting, and we I've used Hoppet before. I'm trying to keep my team consistent on Pokemon that I only found in the Pabellia region. Everyone gains experience from that. Pokedex has been updated. Why did it get updated? Oh, duh, because I caught a Pokemon. All right, that was bringing my mind somewhere else today. Number 16, Hoppip, Cottonweed Pokemon, Grass Flying. The Pokemon is blown across vast, vast distances by the wind. It's unclear where the Hoppip of Pad It's unclear where the Hoppip of Padilla originally came from. No nickname. Add to my party. Another entry. You heard that with my phone going off. I apologize. There was a Fletchling, too. I didn't even see you. I had you fletching, I had you flying in this game. Pascal Gleans was just sitting on the ground. Bite. Peck, that's going to be super effective. So far, I haven't had any catch, uh, trouble catching any Pokemon yet. Now that I say that, probably not catch this fletching on the first ball. If it floats in the air, you're supposed to do that. Got your fletching was caught. Front level to level 3. Pokedex has been updated. Number 19, Fletchling, the tiny robin Pokemon, normal flying. Flying is normally calm, but once it enters battle, it hormonally becomes balance, balance changes and it becomes aggressive. No, no nickname. Another entry. All right, so I'm going to get out of this. Yeah, dang it. I'm going to keep hitting that button, aren't I? All right, that's fine. Um, item over here that I want to grab. Do like how they're hanging from the trees? That's kind of interesting. Sure, potion. I have spray that medicine used for treating wounds. It can use to restore 60% of a Pokemon or 60 HP of a single Pokemon. There's two more here. Potion times one. Another potion. Revive. A medicine that can be used to revive a Pokemon that has fainted. Restores also half the Pokemon's uh, max HP. Or Scatterbug. Didn't see you either. Bite. About half. So I'm going to use Leafage here. The Leafage will actually do less damage if it's a bug type. And that's what I want to do. I want to lower its HP just a little bit more before I try to catch it. String Shot. Lowers my speed. Go, Pokeball. All right, Scatterbug was caught. Experience for everybody, Spurgato hit level eight. Put us an updated. Number 35, Scatterbug. Scatter dust Pokemon, bug. Any poison 
This Pokemon is take is converted into black powder and se secreted. That's why Scatterbug can eat poisonous leaves and routes roots. Scatterbug powder times two. Anything else around here? Another Lechonk over there. There's an item over here. Where's that? Hello? Peachy Bear hold if Pokemon hold those bears are able to lift itself from the poison, they really need a put straight up Pokemon to train paralyzed. They can be used in the Pokemon the free Pokemon that's been paralyzed. They need to slow that shit down. Anyway. What's here? More fletchling. Another Lechonk. Oh, there's an item up there too. What is that? What are you? Oh, you're that uh I think it's a new fire type, uh I don't I don't remember what it is, what it's called. Palmy. Palm you, no palmy. Whatever. Alright. Bite static. Electric type. Interesting. It looks like a fire type. Maybe fire electric? Scratch. Might be a good addition to my party. I gotta see what it how it uh is first. Another one time catch? Alright. Works for me. Gotcha. Palmy was caught. And we're getting experience with Chonker to level 5, Hopic to level 4, and Fletching to level 4. Let's talk more disarming voice. Hopic learned Tail Whip. Number 22, Palmy. Registered. Mouse Pokemon Electric. It has a underdeveloped electric sacs on its cheeks. These discombused electricity of Palmy rubs them furiously with his paws on its, pads on its forepaws. No. Don't want to give it a nickname. Add to party. Get rid of Scatterbug. Yeah, I know about boxes. Not an amateur. Well, amateur in this game anyway. So we're going to take a look at Palmy real quick. Palmy, Electric, Electric. Scratch, Growl, Thundershock. Interesting nature. I wonder if it's, if it's is it supposed to be special based. Hmm. You know what? Should I look that up? Let's look that up real quick. I just want to check out Pommy's like actual stats about going so far into the game. I mean, it's like I gotta open up a couple things. I might be going kind of slow because of uh. Let's see, that was number or something or other like that. Mm, Pommy, right? Pommy. Scroll down past all the stuff that says anything about its evolution. Does it be mixed base? Possibly. Oh yeah, it's actually attack based. So that actually having animate nature is actually better than that's actually a very good uh thing for him. I think I'll keep Pommy. Yeah, let's keep him. Oh crap. My okay, I thought my game froze for a second there. It's like shit, I haven't saved in a while. Um excuse me. Carn through. Coming through. How's it folks? Alright. Revive times one. What is that? Oh, it's another scatter bug. I was like, what the heck? What's going on now? The lighthouse we were supposed to go to. Hey Phoenix, you're gonna get the hang of how to you're getting the hang of how to catch Pokemon, okay? Let me see. So far you've caught. Whoa. That's the cry I've ever heard. Whoa, what was that? Never really crying before. It could be some kind of strong Pokemon or something. That's right. In the beginning, uh, one of the Pokemon fell into the water. I can say we, I see we found whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around, Phoenix. Just be careful. There's a, a, a kind of unsafe cave not far from you, so steer clear. But I know in your real time, it can help you keep, keep you safe. But watch your distance on, by these cliffs anyway. I need to heal. Ether. Messenger was restored 10 power points with a single Pokemon. Yeah, this is normal. Oh boy, that's not good.
Must be territorial. Jeez. Did I use my road time phone to catch myself? That's that was kind of funny. I like that. Yipe yipe. Um, am I gonna battle this thing or? I really hope not, cause I don't have. I can't answer my Pokemon. All right, I guess we're just going in. Just one seems too weak to too weak to move. Need to get something to help perk it up. Oh, I bet you have to use the sandwich, don't I? Yep. I don't know how I'm going to get back up there now. I kind of fell off, you know, and I don't think there's another way in besides the cave, which she told us to stay away from, so we're going to go through it anyway. Do you want us to come with him? It, her, them? Transform. Yep. So I don't think I'm going to just go through the cave. So, unless I can somehow climb out of here. Knowing the way this game is going to go, I'm probably going to have to follow him to make sure he's not going to get hurt again. So far, I'm encountering any, like, real witch. I've seen a couple frame rate issues, but that's about it. Okay. I was actually waiting there for me, it looks like. Yeah, I don't think there's any other way up out of here, so that's the way we're going to go. Alright, so I think that's going to do it for this video. I think I'm going to keep, uh, yeah, what's his name? Uh, Fuiko, I believe his name is. Can I not? I can't even access the, the save, can I? I can use Frigato, though. Guess I'll have to wait. Okay. I can't save quite yet, so I'm going to have to... Inlet Grotto. Guess I'm following him. Is gonna help me get through here. It definitely seems that way. Oi, Phoenix! There you are, Phoenix. You're not hurt, are you? I'm fine. Thanks goodness, I was really worried. Got hurt because I said I should, we should go whatever made that cry. No, never mind that. Right now, we got to focus on getting you back up here. You have to find some way to climb out of there. If you can get close enough, I can try pulling you up with one of my Pokemon's moves. He's definitely waiting for me. There's a Pokemon in front of you. It looks super strong. It kind of seems like it's waiting for you. Does it want it to follow it? And I just picked up another potion. Ooh. So I can access my menu. All right. Well, I guess I'll have to keep going. Wow, that's amazing. This Pokemon might be as strong as mine. Maybe even stronger. A Houndoom. I see it. I'm not going to be able to get anywhere near it. Whoops. Pardon me, I'm just going to steal that. Pokeball times one. Seems like I can't go beyond it because it slows me down if I get too close. Potion times one. The Diglett over there. Oh, 
I can battle. Doesn't seem like I could. Oh, I forgot uh, Sprigato is paralyzed. That's not good. My accuracy just went down as well. Yeah. I might not this out and... I don't, have, I don't think I have anything to heal paralyzation with, so I'm going to have to wait. Sand attack again. Hopefully I can knock it out without it taking several turns. Leaf Edge, it missed. Dang it. Try again. Scratch. Missed again. Scratch. This time I hit. One shot. All right. So I probably could level up Pokemon around here, but I think I probably should be following this Pokemon. Uh, have to leveled up. I'm gonna catch the po see the po grab, grab the items I see around here though. I always come back for the Pokemon. I gotta imagine. Houndour, a lot of them. Looks like they're ticked off. Definitely protected me. From what I don't know. Is there an item over here? Yes, there was. Ends up with some pretty rowdy roundar with here. I'm glad you got a bygar, but watch your back. They're strong. Now what? Oh my gosh, straight pulls around the rock. How powerful even is it? I wonder what the move was. Man, I want to see it up close. Phoenix, look out, something's coming. Maybe a hound doom? It's behind you, it's behind you. I want to battle? Am I even strong enough for this? 40? You gotta be kidding me here. Yeah, I'm, I'm even gonna lose. Why did my Pokemon just retreat like that? I'll roar, that's why, okay. Jeez. Oh, this is not looking good. There's too many of them. Bit of a frame rate issue right there. Hey! Up here, quick! I well, wish we you got saved by Pokemon. A bit of a frame rate issue there, but with a cutscene like that, how can you not have a frame rate issue with a uh, switch holding so much uh, so much horsepower in it? I'm gonna go for a second. I thought you were both goners. Well, what's wrong? Must use all his energy. Maybe use up all its power. What's the Pokemon anyway? Kind of looks like Cycles are, but I don't think I've ever seen one quite like this before. No, it's so different from Minigo. You think it's okay? It's hard to say. Can't tell either, huh, Phoenix? Last night, I'm seriously glad to have you back here in one piece. You know, that battle down there really was something. You and this fellow were perfectly in sync facing the, down that Hound Doom. What, you didn't even tell it what to do? It's not your Pokemon's... Tr you're this Pokemon's trainer yet, huh? Oh, good. Looks like it perked up a little. You think this fellow was the one making that mysterious cry we heard before? 
man, oh man, oh man, the more I look at the Pokemon, the more serious it seems. You do become sure you've got only a battle against it. Let's change the number so we can get in touch if we get somehow get separated again. And here, this will help you teach your, teach your Pokemon to move the to help against stronger opponents. You attain the TM32 Swift. Star shaped rays are shot at the opposing Pokemon. This attack never misses. Same before I use it though. TMs can only use once. Okay, so they went back to the one TM rule. We've both been through enough through enough for them for a minute. We better take I think we better take a breather. Let's go to the lighthouse. That'll be a good spot to relax. Can I access my menu now? Yes, I can. All right. So that's gonna do it for this video. That actually took a lot longer than I thought, but so far I'm not having any issues with the game itself. Other than the frame rate issues of what you're going to do about that. I mean, this, the Switch game, like, for example, for Pokemon, is not meant for cutscenes or anything like that. So it's understandable when you have something like that happen that it just drops frame rates like that. So, so far, no bugs, no issues. I've, I've heard of people having issues when you get on certain things and do certain things. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you, everyone, for watching. This is the Pokemon Fan 1993 signing off. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.